Hello friends, in the playlist of Discovering Statistics Using Jamovi. In known parameter tests, today we will discuss the Wilcoxon sign rank sum test for paired samples. We will discuss its hypothesis, manual calculations, demonstration with software, how to take decision and how to report the findings. The Wilcoxon sign rank sum test or we can say it is also known as sign rank test. The test is named for Frank Wilcoxon. The Wilcoxon sign rank test is designed to test a hypothesis about the location. It does not use mean, it use median or population distribution. It often involves the use of matched pairs. For example, before and after cases, before joining gym, after joining gym, before training, after training. The Wilcoxon sign rank test does not require the assumption that the population is normally distributed. Friends, in paired sample test, it is the assumption that there should be no outlier and the data should be, differences should be differences been before and after differences should be normally distributed but there is no assumption assumption about only data the one dependent variable that is measured at continuous or continuous means ratio or interval level or ordinal scale one independent variable that consists of two categorical related groups matched pair that is dichotomous variable Hypothesis of this test, the median difference, friends, please note down, the median difference between the paired values equal to zero. An alternate hypothesis, the median difference between the paired's value is not equal to zero. Working example, we will work on this example, we might, we might have measured 16 individuals. Performance in a spelling test. The dependent variable is here spelling test. Before and after, they underwent a training to improve spelling. The students were sent for a training. Their responses, correct responses were noted down before training and after training. Now, we have dependent variable, correct responses of spelling test and independent variable before and after training. Test statistics, manual calculation, how to perform, how to, we can, we can calculate this data manually. This is our data set, students, 1 to 16, correct responses before training, correct responses after training. Friends, please note down, you have the marks of or score of the same student before training and after training like in our case next step check the difference 54 minus 40 49 minus 71 we will note down the difference we have calculated differences now rank of absolute difference rank we have to take these values as absolute ignoring plus minus sign minimum value is 1 but here is 0 also we will not take zero in calculation. This value will, will, will be excluded or we can say discarded. Ignoring plus minus sign, minimum value is 1, rank will be 1. Then our next value is 6, the rank will be given 2. And next value is 7 and 7 is 2 times. We will give mean ranks. Mean ranks means 2 times 7. If we give rank individually, 4 and 3 and 4, 3 plus 4 divided by 2, now value comes 3.5. I will write here 3.5 and 3.5. In this way, we will give rank to all these differences ignoring plus minus sign. Next step, rank of positive difference. We will check. This is a positive difference. We will note down the rank here. This is negative difference. We will prepare a separate column for rank of negative difference. Next value is positive. Value will be noted down here. 
here you can check this is negative value the value rank will be noted down in separate column which we have already prepared rank of negative difference in this way take sum total total is 86 and rank of total of rank of negative difference is 34 these values are called t plus positive values or we can say w plus either can be used t minus means rank of total of rank of negative values in this way we have calculated rank positive difference of total is 86 and negative is 34 friends we have noted down the rank of positive values and negative values only how to make decision there is a criteria to reject the null hypothesis if w is greater than equal to table value is less than or equal to table value now what is w and what is table value in case of larger sample in parametric test uh, larger sample has been assumed as greater than 8 w is equal to min minimum value positive or negative value we will check minimum value minimum value is 30 now in this case w will be 34 n is already 16 but there was a one tie which will be discarded and which will be not as, ex, uh, included to check the table value table value will be checked for n is equal to 15 table value at 0, 0. 0. 0. 0.0.05 level of significance i will show you table value is 25 now we will compare this value this is our rule w is less than or equal to table value but in our case r w is 34 table value is 25 34 is greater than 25 means our null hypothesis not rejected failed to reject it means there is no significant difference between the before and after training score friends i have already told you we i will show you how to check the table we have to check the table at n is equal to 15 in this table n is equal to 15 n is equal to 15 here we are performing here two real test and at the level of significance 0 0.05 you can check the value it is 25 we i have noted down from here friends now i will show you how to calculate z statistics to calculate z statistics we have used this value total of ranks of positive values and total of ranks of negative value in calculating z test statistics it uses t max value max value is 86 <clears throat> the formula for test statistics t bar standard error and with the help of these two values we will calculate z statistics x minus x bar upon standard error here we will use t minus t bar upon standard error of t now, now put the values by putting the values t bar is 60 standard error is 17.6607 and z is equal to we will put here z t is equal to 86 and t bar 60 and standard error 17.607 then we will get 4.176 now we will compare this value calculated value with 1.96 if this value is greater than 1.96 null hypothesis is rejected but our value is less so we can say null hypothesis will be accepted means there is no significant difference in the marks of students before and after training Format for to perform the test in software will coaxen sign ranks some test data entry format variables two variables before training after training in first column we will note down the scores before training correct responses have been noted down in column two after training correct responses have been noted down friends let's perform the test using Jamovi my file name will coaxen sign rent as spelling test do, dot omv 
friends let's open the jmovi this is my jmovi file in jmovi file before training after training before performing the test i would like to calculate the differences between before and after training to calculate before training after training in data tab compute compute i would like to calculate in this box in this uh, column compute in compute type here differences difference difference between here is a drop down arrow difference between after training double click minus before training enter now you can check differences has been calculated this is a extra column we will delete this column differences are zero means no change negative sign means reverse change positive sign means there is increase in score correct in uh, correct responses we can note down minus sign how many values of minus sign 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 10 values now how to calculate wilcoxon rank test in analysis tab t test paired sample t test shift the variables after training to paired variables before training to next box and we would like to perform we don't require students click on wilcoxon and click on descriptive let's check the output in output reason here you can check wilcoxon w this is statistics means manual calculation if we perform this test w value p p means significance level significance value we will compare we i will show you how to report and how to take decision these are the median let's come to our slides and i will show you how to interpret our results friends how to interpret results wilcoxon w statistics 34 p 0.147 software generated value we will compare this value with our level of significance we have taken here at 5% means 0.05 if this value is less than 0.05 we will reject the null hypothesis but in our case this value is more than this so we will fail to reject the hypothesis null hypothesis or we can say we will accept the null hypothesis to take decision on the basis of statistics i have already shown you to compare with table value this is the median and now how to report before reporting we will use these two tables after training before training n is equal to 16 median is equal to 52 median is equal to 53 and our z statistics is 1.476 we have already calculated it because jmovi does not provide this value of the 16 participants recruited to the study the training program elicited and decrease in marks of 10 participants as i shown you while performing the test in jmovi compared to before training whereas one participant show no improvement and only five participants have secured marks more than before training a wilcoxon sign rank test determined that there was no statistically significant difference between marks before training median was 53 after training median was 52 z is equal to 1.476 w this is the value w and this is the value of p in this way we can perform the wilcoxon sign rank sum test friends i hope this video will be useful for you thank you my friends